In the morning when our students come in, we'll greet them, we'll do our screening process. So our sixth graders will be in our auditorium and you'll notice in this room we have the seats numbered according to the CDC guidelines for social distancing so the students will only sit where there is a number. So you'll notice on the floor we have directional decals and so students who are walking in this direction on this side of the hallway um, will be following the bear paw in that direction and then in the opposite direction the bear paws are facing that way. This is a holding area uh, in the morning for our eighth graders and then we have on each of the seats markers for the students so they know which seats they should sit in and which seats they should not sit in so that in the event of contact tracing we know exactly where students have been sitting. There are arrows for them to know which way to walk and then on that side they would know not to be walking through that door. The desks are six feet apart and then they have markers on the floor because of course kids are kids and they move around and so do their desks so this is a way for them to ensure that they are maintaining the proper social distance. This is a classroom sanitization kit that every single teacher will get. For parents who are coming to pick up students who have um, exhibited symptoms, they will use this entrance here. And it is closer to our health room, which is gonna be in our gym. And this is a very big and well-ventilated space. So um, students will wait here until their parents are able to pick them up if they're not feeling well. And I've never been more confident about the group of leaders that we have in the school and the way they're implementing these. I mean, when you have 155, you've got to give guidelines. You've got to trust the leaders that you have at schools to, to put these plans together, but then obviously provide oversight to make sure that's happening. And that's where our assistant superintendents come in. And we've asked them to come in and make sure they're walking the building with the leaders to ensure that's happening. So through all of that, I'm very confident.